Just explain why you've gone short on this stock. You think uh, investors are misreading trial data here? Yeah, we think the stock should re-rate. I think the street is way too bullish on the phase one, two trial uh, data. So the street seems to think that that data shows that the drug is efficacious. We don't think the trial data shows that it's efficacious. In fact, we think that it shows results that are consistent with prior treatments of mostly chemotherapy that the trial patients underwent. And the other thing is we think the street, even if the drug is efficacious and gets approved, we think the street is really overly optimistic about the peak annual sales because they're assuming that the drug is going to price around 200 to 300,000 US. And we just don't see payers reimbursing for this treatment, uh, which is additive at that level. So there's two things there. You're saying that investors are misreading the trial data. I mean, they're going through phase 2B data now to try and accelerate FDA approval. And, and analysts out there seem pretty optimistic at this stage that it could get EU and US approval by 2019. Why? What are they misreading? So what they're looking at in the, in the phase 1 and 2 data, um, they're showing, they're looking at these results in how these uh, these blood levels, call them biomarkers, seemingly improved for the patients who were enrolled. And when we look at that, because again, these patients had all previously on, undergone other therapies, we actually think that the improvements really could be attributable to those previous therapies. Because importantly, in clinical trial world, there was no what they call washout period to ensure that there were no lingering effects of previous treatments. And so that's what we think um, the, the street is misunderstanding. Now the company could release a decent bit more data. They could release granular patient by patient data, which would allow everybody to make a better judgment about this. But so far the company has decided not to do that, which you know we kind of think that's a little bit that's a little bit conspicuous that they won't release that individual patient data.